Join me as I travel solo through India, a land of endless diversity and sensory experiences, where each destination offers its own unique adventure. Today we're moving from Pondicherry to Arrowville. Let's discover what wonders this quarter of India holds for us. Good morning, I think. No, good afternoon. <laughs> uh, we are in Pondicherry. Um, but we are going. I'm just waiting for a, for a, I'm not sure what it is, like an Uber, but it's an Uber car. In Pondicherry, they don't really have proper Ubers. It's a little bit different, but it's through Uber. Uh, we are going to Arrowville, Arrowville, Arrowville. So Arrowville is like kind of a like alternative international community. It's just outside of Pondicherry. Uh, one of the main reasons why I was coming here to Pondicherry actually. So yeah, I booked in there for a few nights. Uh, just waiting for this guy. It's a bit of a strange one because yeah, it's, I'm going to do a car. I haven't done a car yet. Wait, let's see if it works. Should be okay. Uh, yeah, he's coming. That way. Let's see. Yeah, I think he's coming this way somewhere. So, yeah, I guess when he turns up, maybe I'll tell you a bit more in the uh, in the taxi. Cool. Yeah, that didn't work. So, I think, I'm not sure. <laughs> I think I'm gonna, yeah. He wanted like twice as much. I guess because he's got to go all the way out there. I kind of understand that, because then he's going to go out, come all the way back. Not what he said, he said, oh, it's more, it's more, and blah, 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 whatever. It may be. The, the Uber hasn't updated something, something. So, yeah. He wanted like 800 or something. So I'm going to go to try the bus stop. Well, I might try these guys. Let's, let's try these guys, maybe. <laughs> Uh, I'm not sure how much how much they're gonna they're gonna want to charge me. Okay, let's give it a go. Hello, hello. I'm going to Arrowville. Hello, we're okay. How much? How much? How much? Huh? How much? One, one, one drop. One way, yeah. Four hundred. Okay. Yeah. Four hundred is okay. Can you do that? Okay. Okay? Yeah, good. Uh, District center? No, I, I have a guest house. Guest house? Yeah. Guest house? Uh, you know? You know? Yeah, Verity it's called. There. I'll show you. Uh, uh, yeah, so the, I think the, so this is the dome here. Our yeah, that's the big dome. Mandri. Yeah, yeah, that's there. We're just above. Yeah, <laughs> that's okay. Uh, okay, five hundred. Uh, four fifty. Five hundred. Uh, yeah, long, long. Four fifty. Five hundred. Please. Okay, five hundred. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Coming from New Zealand. New Zealand. Yes. Okay, what country? Yeah, New Zealand. New Zealand. Yes. And you? Where are you from? You from Pondicherry? Ah, Pondicherry. Yeah. India. India. Pondicherry. <laughs> Jai Hind. Pondicherry. Oh, David. Jai Hind. <laughs> okay. So we're going. We're going. 500 or whatever. One say petrol. Ah, you want petrol? Petrol, petrol. petrol. Okay, you need petrol. Sure. Okay. Thank you. Okay, petrol station. Wow. I haven't been to one of these. Welcome. 
need to learn some new words, guys. I want to know how to say friend. My friend. If you know how to say my friend, let me know. Fishing though. <laughs> so yeah, the, the, the Uber thing. Uh, it was supposed to be like about 400, but yeah, the guy said Uber hadn't updated it or something. This guy's just doing, I mean, yeah, the autos are so much cheaper to run, I guess. But yeah, he said 400, I was like, yeah. Now he's saying 500 because it is a little bit north of like the central. That's fine. Yes, yeah, so we're going to Arabil. Uh, I'm staying at a place called Verity Learning Center and Yoga, something like this. Um, they have like daily yoga, obviously, daily meditations. Uh, and generally, in a lot of Arabil, there's like kind of workshops and you know, things that could kind of elevate your consciousness, if you like, or you know, at least just give you some peace and quiet. Yeah, Arab was like the it's supposed to be kind of like a I guess born of like a utopian ideal in a way. I'm not sure 100 percent sure it's worked how the uh, founders wished, but it still sounds like a great place, huh? Maybe I'm not sure if I'll be able to talk with this show, but maybe. Uh, Ah, yeah, it's not too late. Uh, yeah, so... I've been there for a few days. Uh, there's also, like, the famous kind of thing there is this big golden dome, which you actually can... Uh, it's supposed to be like a, a central... kind of a, a central node of, like, energy. Kind of. Uh, which which uh, is really good for meditation. So there's daily meditations here. You have to book quite far in advance. Um, yeah, I haven't booked yet. And for some reason, I can't book on a Tuesday, which is tomorrow. And you can only book between seven and 12 on the other days. So I've missed out on booking, but I have emailed them. So maybe I can go on the Wednesday or Thursday or something. I don't know. Yeah, but it's supposed to be like this kind of this uh, or place for all humans, all mankind, all races, creeds, religions, spiritual or not. Um, it was uh, founded originally by Sri Aurobindo, so we went to his ashram. Yes, a couple of days ago. I couldn't show you inside because there was no like filming inside of that. And that was another woman, his wife, the mother. The mother. So the mother is, um, she was French and Arabindo was Indian. And then they came together and founded this place. It's just north of Pondicherry. Oh, on fire. Yeah. Maybe I'll yeah uh, I'll I'll do some more research about it and I'll tell you a bit more. Right now it may be a bit hectic. Once we get there, uh, I mean I can plan on like kind of walking around. There's like all sorts of guest houses. Cool. Each one kind of has a different theme, let's say, or like a different type of community. It's like international, there's creative, there's spiritual, there's yoga, there's eco sustainability, you know, where you can learn all this stuff. And you can also teach there as well if you want. Um, yeah, I can tell you more about it, I guess, when we get it. Let's go.
thinking. So yeah, we've got quite a bit of time. So I'm going to try out this new this mic that I've got. It's like a wireless mic that connects to the to the Pocket 3 to the camera. So yeah, we've got about a bit of time. Probably about half an hour to be honest. It is a long drive. Um, so I thought I'd read to you. <laughs> to a little journey story no it's uh, basically just uh, like some information from the Arrowville website so Arrowville the city of the dawn uh, Arrowville wants to be a universal town so where are we going oh we're going that way okay <laughs> It wants to be a universal town where men and women of all countries are able to live in peace and progressive harmony above all creeds, all politics, and all nations, all nationalities, sorry. The purpose of Arrowville is to realize human unity. So the purpose of Arrowville is to realize human unity in diversity. Today, Arrowville is recognized, whoops, is recognized as one, as the first and only internationally endorsed ongoing experiment in human unity and transformation of consciousness. Sounds good to me. So here's the vision of the city. City the earth needs. Arrowville, sometimes referred to as the city of the dawn is conceived for 50,000 inhabitants from around the world. At the center stands Matrimatri, uh, the soul of the city, a place for individual silent concentration, so sort of like meditation. In the oval-shaped peace area, surrounded by a lake, Radiating out beyond the lake are four zones, industrial to the north, cultural to the northeast, residential south-southwest, and international west, each focusing on an important aspect of the town's life. Surrounding the township will be a green belt consisting of forest areas, farms, and sanctuaries. Sounds good to me, and it's kind of, yeah, the city's kind of laid out in like, circle kind of kind of kind of ah, yes so yeah the place for a whole bunch of hippies basically <laughs> more or less so i'm gonna go try and join them no well i'm just gonna you know see what it's about like you know there's a different way of living yeah i come well i come from new zealand but i um, i've been living in like a warehouse community in London, an artist creative community, which is kind of like this alternative living style of community. So yeah, this really intrigues me. I was very involved in it, helping like create events and exhibitions and festivals and stuff there, uh, all revolving around this one street, like a full of warehouses and creative weirdos. So yeah, I'm trying to find something like that in India. Sounds interesting. Just something different, right? Something different. So yeah, hopefully you heard all that with this microphone. Uh, and we'll be there, I wouldn't say shortly, but eventually. <laughs> cool guys, nice one. Here we go. To like the to the greenery out of the urban you know obviously Chennai is very much a city Pondicherry was as well I didn't really expect that I thought it was gonna be more like a seaside beach chill town maybe just where I was staying was very busy um, but yeah you can see maybe here behind me it's all um, Greenery. Just like, oh, 
uh, yeah, kind of, and you say farms, forests, trees, and dusty roads. Although this is paved, but yeah, it's like an amazing, hang on, let's show, I'll show you. It's like amazing uh, green, uh, red earth. I like this kind of, yeah, very red mud, if you like. Hang on. I think we have to find out where we're going. You know where we're going? Well, the guard man at the front knew where we were going. Interesting that there's guards here. But I guess, you know, it's quite unusual. There's the dusty roads now, though. Like there's a lot more like foreigners around here just riding around as opposed to just obviously walking around but there's not much to walk around I guess <laughs> jumping See all the dust is kind of like collected onto the trees there. Ah, sure is nice to be out in green. All right, well, we're inside our Auroville, so this is Auroville. We need to find our gift pass. Um, I think just coming up. Soon, maybe the big gold thing. What? Yeah, okay. <laughs> ah, yeah, I see. I'm not sure he's gone the right way, but that's fine. Ah, okay, yeah. He's just gone the inside of Arrowville way, which is fine. Whereas I think my Google was telling me that outside of Arrowville Bay. <sighs> okay. Just got a glimpse of the Golden Dome. Let's see if you can see it. Oh, that's massive. You see it just over the fence there? Maybe. Oh. <laughs> uh, it's behind the trees there, but maybe you can see it between the trees. The listening gold. Cool, I got I think I've got to help this guy get to our place. This way. Yeah. If I didn't have Google Maps, I'd be completely lost here. <laughs> okay, can I put the camera away? Okay. Fifty. No. <laughs> 50. No, man. Five hundred. Long, long. Yeah, but you said I. You said four hundred. No return. You said four hundred. No return. 50. No. 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 Thank you. Nindri. Nindri. <laughs> Gosh. Okay. So this is the place, guys. Um, might just turn the camera off because I don't want it to be the first introduction to me. Look, obviously, there's. Bicycles, I think actually you can get free bicycles here. I think they're, they're, it's kind of part of it all. <sighs> he was trying to um, up the price, which I mean, he already did. So I you know, had to stand my ground on that one. He just did it with a smile, so that's that's fine. Because um, he originally said 400, then I showed him where it was on the map, and he said 500. I was like, uh, okay. <laughs> And now he wants 550, 600. I'm like, no, 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 no. So, you know, you... I think that's fair. And he seemed happy. It wasn't like he was 
angry about it, so that's all good. Okay, gosh. Just in that little bit, these cameras got all covered in. Covered in uh, dust. Okay, I'm gonna put the camera away. Okay, guys, we're here. Da -da -da -da. So, this is Verity Guest House in Arroville. And already, maybe you can tell, I'm whispering. <laughs> um, yeah, check it out, guys. Uh, yeah, I'll show you around this way. Da -da -da -da. Cool. So, yeah, very much in the in the trees. It's actually, just what I need to be honest. Can't hear any cars. There's no tooting. There's no tooting, guys. Wow. <laughs> uh, I haven't really had a look around. Um, so actually, where I was previous, where they dropped, where the guy dropped me off. That's actually where the programs are, so that's not it's a different door or a different gate to get into the actual place, to uh, the actual guest house. Um, these are the toilets. Let's have a look. Oh, wow, it's like a double. It's like got the you know, Asian squatting toilet and then the, the actual seat on the top. And then just, yeah, I guess there's a shower in there somewhere. Shower, shower, maybe. Yeah, that looks like a shower. Okay, yeah, that's a shower. Cool. Um, and then I guess maybe these are wells even. I'm not sure. Well, looks a bit like wells. Oh, I can hear a motor now. No! <laughs> yeah, there doesn't seem to be anybody around. I, I think the place is booked out there. Quite a lot of the places are. Um, obviously there's you know, rooms there, rooms there, rooms there, rooms everywhere, double stories, probably your own little bungalow thing there. But yes, this is it. My place here, it's called Faith. Great. Oh, that's good. That's, that's, that's actually what I need. <laughs> And um, this is the room. It actually look, looks like it's a double room. Two beds, fan. Uh, it looks like, you know, it's very open, but that there is to keep, I don't know if you can see it actually, but there are actually mosquito kind of mesh on the top, which is great. Cupboard, double cupboard. So this is Sri Aurobindo. And this is the mother, if you didn't know. And here's some guest information. There's all sorts of things going on. Uh, cool. Wow. Awesome. Um, what am I going to do? I don't know. I was looking at the prices. They seem a bit expensive. Oh, um, I'll have another look. I'll have another look. Uh, it seemed like something like 4500 for like some of the courses and things, maybe yoga and stuff, which is like 45 pounds. I'm not sure. I had another look. I took a photo of a couple of them. You can go over there at some point. Um, not sure how much I can really show you in terms of actually doing the things, if we're going to be doing the things. Uh, but yeah, I'm pretty happy just chilling even here and just kind of exploring a little bit. I think I get I think it's kind of like a first come first serve on the uh, bicycles. So there's bicycles around somewhere. Cool. <laughs> wow. We're here guys, we're here. Actually, yeah, I might just take a break. So maybe I will leave you to it for now and then we can maybe go exploring. The time is, the problem is I always get here and then it's kind of like the afternoon and then obviously here it becomes night time at six o'clock. Um, I'm here for a couple of days so let's just have a rest eh? 
Okay, so I'm going to have a rest. You're going to push subscribe. And I'll see you on the next one. Until then, keep on drifting. Thank you.